how are you going? Um, my name's Sarah. My group is Oily Licious Mama. I'm part of this amazing team um, we've got here presenting this event here tonight. We've heard some from some amazing speakers tonight. Um, first up was Kim with her um, applying oils and welcoming everybody. Then we had uh, Kelly showing us how to use the diffusers. Um, Natalie shared with us her favorite premium starter kit oils. Um, Nicole is running the game, which is um, still going. So if you want to win a pine oil, jump on the Duck Duck Goose game and comment there to, for your chance to win. Hey Jeremy, how are you going? Um, and then we had Sharon with her uses of the Thieves um, Household Cleaner, which is amazing by the way. I absolutely love that one. Um, so I'm going to do a little DIY. Um, just put the little one to bed, or should I say my husband is putting her to bed, so I wasn't going to be running late. Um, if you're watching, say hi. Um, let me know how your day's been. Um, I just wanted to um, share with you something quite simple that I absolutely love. Um, give me a like or a love or comment hands up in the um, comments below if you've got kids. I've got one. You're welcome Sharon. Um, whose child has tantrums? who feels like they're having tantrums when their child is having a tantrum. <laughs> um, oh, you're just putting the girls to bed too. Yep, that's good. I know Kim's out tonight. Busy, busy. Um, so this blend that I'm going to make tonight is a roller blend. Um, it's one of my favourites. Um, I've shared this with quite a few friends and it's helped not only them but their kids a lot. Um, my little one had a meltdown yesterday and was inconsolable. I rubbed this on her and within five minutes she was calm, smiling and happy again. So I love having my little rollers. I use them for all different things, not just for calming. I like to carry them around in my little case which is really handy to have on hand when you don't know when you're going to need them because um, I like to have my oils everywhere. So um, this one is one of my blends that I'm going to share with you. Um, after this live, I'll actually pop the recipe in the comments in case you missed it. So I'm using a amber glass roller. It's best to have glass or stainless steel for your oils. And dark glass is the best too because it um, prolongs the life of your oils without the sunlight getting in. So um, you can get grab these online, these are absolutely wonderful. Or if you're finished with your bottles, as Kim showed us before, you can pop your Young Living roller on the top and just reuse your bottles and you don't have to go out and buy these. So that's really, really handy. Um, so my blend kind of goes against the dilution rules. It's a little bit overboard. Um, if you're new to essential oils, you could probably halve the drops of this um, recipe. Or what I would suggest to do, like Kim said earlier, is to do a patch test just on the back of your hand and just make sure that you don't get any sort of reaction to that. Um, I like this combination. So as I said, you can play with any sort of combinations for calming oils that you like. Uh, this one really works for me and others that I've shared it with. So I just wanted to share this one with you. Um, so four drops of each. As I said, if you're new to oils um, and you don't want that many straight away, you can always add one drop of each or two drops of each, whatever you like. But I add four drops of each. So it makes a total of 32 drops. Normally in a 10 ml um, roller bottle, suggested 10 to 15 drops and then your carrier oil. But yeah, I broke the rules there and um, we've been fine with it. 
so it helps and that's all this mama needs right now so one, my first oil is the lovely bergamot so I'll put four drops of bergamot in there now you always hold on a 45 degree angle as Kim was saying before comes out a little hole on the side not the one in the middle so if you hold it this way um, the air is getting trapped so it won't drop out um, yeah bergamot that's lovely that's really uplifting that one I love that one one of my favorites that I had to put on before this live was Valor because I'm so nervous um, before I jumped on I was rubbing it all over me and putting my hands and smelling it um, just so I could get through this and share this with you without stuffing up too much so oh yes Sharon emergency toolkit yep we've got to have those in our bag those ca cases are great you can get those online too um, Valor is good for many many things so I'll put four of that in it's a lovely blue oil can you see that pretty this is absolutely amazing I love this one in my perfume Three. Some oils drop out faster than others. Um, some are thicker, some are thinner. There's actually one that I've had to put down my top tonight because it's really thick and if it's not warm, it was going to take forever. And I only have a certain time slot that's slot here. Um, so I'll get that done. So next one is frankincense. Good old Frankie, the king of oils. This one is amazing. Great grounding oil. So grounding you when you're about to lose it or if your kids losing it one three four this one comes in, oh, lost it there we go comes in your premium starter kit as well so that is really really good another one that comes in your premium starter kit that Kim was talking about before stress away can't get enough of stress away Give me a like or a love if you're watching this and this is going to be helpful for you. Um, four drops of stress away. Two, three, four. You're all sitting back having a drink tonight, joining on the event. I should be I should have a drink. Something's wrong with me. I should have a drink with me. Anyway, four of stress away. That basically explains self-explanatory what that blend is <laughs> um, I use it quite a lot another one that's in the kit is good old lavender the Swiss Army knife of oils this one is amazing calming oh there's so many uses for this one I'm not even going to go into that but in this blend it's for calming so for that go nearly done Another one I love to add in, this one's not in the starter kit, but you can um, order that another time, cedar wood. This is amazing calming oil as well. So four of that one. And it's nearly empty, so I might have to get my other one. Just roll it around if it's not coming out and it's going to take forever just let me open my other one okay it should be um this one's a little bit thicker so it's a little slower four need to lots of cedar wood another one in the premium starter kit is copaiba this one's um, amazing for a lot too very calming and this one also magnifies this is a magnifying oil so it's going to magnify all the other oils in your blend whatever you use it for four of this one um, this is just a blend that I love. If you um, want to try your own calming blends, go for it. There are 
lots of calming oils that you can try. Um, I even do basic ones if I need to. Um, there's not much of that one too. Another one, peace and calming. It seems like a lot, but as I said, you can do your own. And this one works. So I absolutely love this one. Peace and calming. This one smells amazing. It's um, not too strong on the florally side. It's a little bit sweet. Um, think of spring. Yeah. It's just... Mm, that one's just really, really good. That one's nearly empty too. So I will see how I go. That one's going to take a bit to come out. And I didn't get a spare. So I'll just cheat. Take that off. So, two, three, four. And I spilled a bit of that because it's not a very thick oil. <laughs> so I'll just rub that on. I'm not going to waste it. And the last one, excuse me. This is one I had to warm up. Vetiver. Great for um, sleeping. So it's also a very calm oil too. And this one, I've got to crack it open. This is the last one. Four of that. It's really thick, so I'm hoping it doesn't take too long to... One, two, three, four. There we go. That blend is amazing. I've had um, some great feedback from that one, so... You can I'll pop the recipe in the comments below when I'm done and you can give that a go um, and see there it fills it up to about here and then just fill it up with carry oil I'm I've run out of the young living v6 oil so I'm just using fractionated coconut so I just fill that up there you go Hey, hi, if you're watching, I can see there's a couple of people on. Just mix that together. Um, I love rolling that on my wrists. Anywhere where your veins are close to the surface. Neck. Even if you want to. On your hand. And smell it in for a few minutes. Um, on my daughter, I like to put it on the back of her neck as well. And sometimes across here. So... That is my calming blend. I'll post the recipe in the comments later. Um, if you... Yes, Stephanie, definitely give it a go. It's really, really, really good. Um, if anyone else has got a great calming blend, share it in the comments below. Um, the more people that comment, the better, because at the end of the weekend, I'm going to go through the comments and pick a random winner and I'm going to post this straight to you to give it um, a go. Um, stay tuned for 9 o'clock. The amazing Stephanie Leader will be sharing oils for bedtime. I hope that was helpful. And um, yeah, give that one a go. If you need calming or your kids are losing it and you, they need to calm them down, this one. Give it a go. All right. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. See you again soon. Bye.